Palestinians mass along the border with Israel. The gathering's been organized by Hamas, which controls Gaza. The March of Return is a show of defiance and determination to claim land many Palestinians believe is rightfully theirs. Our Palestinian people are determined to hold on to their national rights, including the right of return. And the occupation should be held accountable for these crimes against unarmed civilians. 34 Palestinians have died in the last two weeks, and today there was more bloodshed and violence. The Palestinian Health Authority says one man was killed and nearly a thousand people injured, 223 by gunfire. The Israelis call the march rioting and have used tear gas, rubber-coated bullets and live ammunition to stop Palestinians who approach the border. Watching from the other side, these Israelis believe the use of deadly force on the Palestinian protesters is justified. This is enemy state. Gaza, it's enemy state. We leave Gaza before 15 years ago. Gaza today belongs to itself, to the Hamas. We don't control Gaza. Gaza is free country, OK? They want to come to our country now. The United Nations Secretary General has called for an investigation into the violence, and the EU has urged Israeli soldiers to show utmost restraint. But today, blood continued to be spilt. Hamas says its rolling protests, attended by thousands of supporters, will continue into next month marking the 70th anniversary of the creation of the State of Israel and what many Palestinians see as the catastrophe which followed. Nick Wallace, News at 10.